So welcome back my strictly lovely people. Welcome back to my channel, Jay Anta Magala. Hope you guys already brought a friend to bring a friend to give this inspiring and motivational word of today. I still have the reading open from the last video, okay? Since we are not knowing what we must fight to show, to awaken um, our energy within our romantic love life, let's see the overall energy of the romantic love with the love oracles explaining the love of the romantic of the romantic feelings okay look we got ascending love y'all i just broke the deck up okay you are transcending obstacles you are learning you are expansion to a new phase you are preparing for a union what, what is this union? Unconditional love, self-love, oneness, passion, affection, and attraction. Because, to be honest, you already know that you are calling in your soulmate. Okay? And the one that you are calling in, I clarify not, to be a part of your word, to be a part of your community, is your soulmate. So, let's clarify what you have to fight out. <clears throat> Within your romantic feelings. Clarify your feelings. Clock. The person, the man is holding their heart. They know your feelings are real and worth this form, but they need time. They take time. Okay, they need time to heal. They in a process, in a progress. But you know what? You have to fight them off. This one, this is something you have to fight off to move forward now we are moving forward because they over there healing they healing they don't know how to give love that's why they holding their heart they don't know how to give love so they're not going to pour into your romantic feelings let's see what you calling in your soulmate look i kid you not that's why i kept this reading open y'all for you to be archangel Uriel with the crown chakra with the knowing that you are calling in your soulmate through prayers, affirmation, visualization that was going to bring you guys together, you get wedding ring. I kid you not, you get a wedding ring. You know who you calling in, which is your soulmate. They are part of your community now, in this present moment. It's a union, a wedding. You can to be married to a soul connection. I don't know, I don't know. Is this for you, okay? This, if this for you, please... Okay, comment down below. But for, for most of my collective, you guys are going to be in a union um, with internal love, everlasting promises within your community. Because you know why? This is exactly why this card said, yes, this is your soulmate because you are married now. <laughs> you are married now. Let's clarify your soul. Look at this. The Phoenix. You and your soulmate now is on a new phase. Y'all finna rekindle. Y'all finna rekindle the prayers, the affirmation, the visualization. Okay? Y'all finna rekindle that. Y'all, this, this union right here, okay, is a transformation for growth and a change of mind. What, what is this change of mind? Y'all finna get to know each other on your temple path. Within the mind, body, and soul. Oh. This one came out, y'all. Okay. Y'all finna get to know each other. So, y'all finna meet up. The overall energy. Y'all finna meet up. Savor the moment. Y'all finna talk about it. Y'all finna uplift each other. Y'all finna talk about y'all at the friendship stage, okay? Y'all see that? Y'all finna get ready to get to know each other. And who who you finna get to know? Your twin flame. This is not no soulmate just yet, okay? This is not a soulmate is when you connect with them physically, raw, okay? You know what I'm talking about? Sex. But you and your twin flame haven't did that yet. So y'all, y'all in the friendship, your honeymoon phase. And this, 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 this moment, this meeting, y'all savoring the moment is meant to bring balance again, union, duality, 
coupling. Y'all are complimenting each other. Y'all are going out on dates. This person is taking you out. Look at that, taking you out to beautiful places. Taking you to the temple path where you need to be. As if you fit there, as if you belong there. And y'all going to rise, y'all rekindling. Y'all transforming and growing together. And I think that's it. What's the overall energy? What's the overall energy for my collective love life? Within a romantic love life, overall energy. Your overall energy is, you guys, I'm going to say you finna to date. Like I said, you finna date your twin flame, okay? You meet to someone new. You meet to someone new. You dating, getting back out there, and y'all setting dates to meet up with each other over and over again. It's going to be a consistent thing, so you won't feel heartbroken, okay? So you won't feel deeply hurt, sad, or separated from the breakup. So, you know, when y'all do separate from each other, you won't be grieving, you won't be mourning. You finna date someone, so, of course, it's going to be a lot of meeting up, savoring the moment. So, this, this is very beautiful. This is beautiful, y'all. You deserve this. What you don't see coming, they, 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 you guys going to be addicted to each other. And what is coming is, okay, lightning, sudden change, shocking news, a surprise, something finna be on, on, on reveal. This is a trans, transformation. Something gonna be like instantly come in so fast. Who was finna come in so fast? Okay. Someone who's addicted to you. Even though if it's the person from the past, well, they ain't got no business coming to you. They can't even come to you. They need time to heal their broken heart. They need time, the, the heart that they are holding on to. They need to, um, they're going to be exploring their own feelings by themselves first. They finna get to know themselves. But you, on the other hand, collective, you you got so much good stuff up here on the table. So, <laughs> your karmic, like I said, what you don't see coming, your karmic, the one in the past, of course, they like you. They don't love you, but from the past, this is why they hold their heart. They like you, okay? They, they are reminiscing for themselves because they still holding their heart. That romance is blooming for them and for you, but it's not like that because they are a karmic. They are karmic. They are triggered. They have trauma. They they resentment. They have lessons to go through because they did not let go nor love you. And they're just a codependent energy for someone in the past. So anyway, we ain't gonna just be worried about the past because we have to fight them off and we showing that we know we have victory which awakens the power that we sense of the knowing because you are calling it in what you are calling in your soulmate this union this love this date night special night getting to know someone okay someone who's really into you someone who like you and someone who love you Okay, all because of your power. If this resonated with you guys, please like, comment, subscribe, ring that bell. Make sure you bring a friend in this time. Okay, don't don't leave no one out from. Don't be selfish. Make sure everyone get this motivation, inspiring word for the day. Okay, of love. Until next time, I'll be back with another read. Can your girl get a whoop whoop? Bye, collective. <laughs>